What up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Lunchtime Lottery. I'm to hear more. I'm Patrick Cloud. And this is an amazing show that we love to do because we like to eat. Love eating. So if you've never seen Lunchtime Lottery before, we are going to open up Postmates and order food for each other. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to review it and eat it for you guys. Now, so. Pat, Pat likes to do this thing where he likes to order me exactly what I don't want, okay. uh, which makes him a creep. All right. And I'm just going to go ahead and say that. And in turn, I tend to do that as well. Yeah, I wouldn't say I go for what you don't want. It's just something that could add a little spice. So mm -hmm. if you haven't seen our first episode, he's never had wasabi. And we had some sushi. So I made sure that he was properly introduced to wasabi. Right. This green stuff is wasabi, right? Mm -hmm. Is this spicy? Like mm -hmm. spicy, spicy? Super spicy. You ever had wasabi? Is this too much? You should add a little more. You think so? Mm-hmm. Like that much? That's good? That's good. That should be good. I'm not even gonna lie, that was a lot of wasabi. That was a lot of wasabi. You really never had wasabi before. <laughs> maybe, maybe today I'll give you something that you like, but it's just a little new, you know? Just a little new. Well, let's, let's not go for wild, let's just go for I just, you know? I just want delicious food. That's all I want. I really just want some good food. Samesies. You know, that's it. Mm -hmm. We always pull a genre of food, and then the other person picks the restaurant on Postmates. So right. um, go ahead and shake this up. Uh, Come on, give uh, me something good. Today right. we are going Greek. I can do Greek. Greek is very slept on in terms of, like, style of food. Like, especially being on set. Yeah. We are always ordering Greek food because it's light. Mm -hmm. They have options for everybody, veggie options and all that stuff. And um, depending on the place, it can get a little spicy. Yeah, you can. Greek or Mediterranean, both of them could do that. And it, they have a lot of options for everybody. Let's go into it. So I'm going to just open up Postmates and we're going to see uh, what's what's going on around here. We like to uh, focus on the local businesses, mm -hmm. you know, through this pandemic. I'm going to I'm going to be completely honest. I'm not comfortable with how excited you are about this right now cuz I feel like this is a setup for your boy. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to just do a little little scroll, see what we got. And uh, all right. New York chicken and gyro? Gyro? I gyro. never know. I never know if it's, it's, it's gyro or gyro. Gyro. I, 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 I gyro. sweat every time mm -hmm. I'm, I'm a, a, like at the cashier about to order because I never know what to go with. I'm, I'm glad that you that you had to say that one and not me. I just kind of piggyback off whatever gyro. wrong thing you said. Let's try this place out. Um, got some falafel. Uh, of course, I got some eat gyros. Ooh, the chicken gyro. Look at that meat. It looks spicy. It does. It also looks like flaming hot Cheetos. It looks like hot Cheeto meat. I'm not I'm not mad at it. I'm kind of always all. interested. So uh got a couple mixed plout, some lamb. Plout. How do you feel about lamb? Never really had it. Okay. Interesting. All right, well Don't um, say don't say interesting like that. I don't say like interesting like that cuz that sounds like you plotting. Well, hear me out. Cuz I don't want you to just have something you don't like, right? So let's go with this mixed gyro, okay? First, it looks delicious, all right? It got lettuce, tomato, uh, it got some savory spiced chicken with white sauce, but there's a little diced lamb in there. I threw some bad, I threw some sheep See, in there. See, when you make the sound? Some baby sheep. It doesn't, it doesn't help when you make the sound. You want to eat a little baby sheep? Okay, you know what? Go ahead and get that. And then yeah. I'm going to see I'm going to see what we got for you. I, I think that's going to be good. It's not it's not a challenge. Mm, okay. It's not I it's not it, too I weird. Think I think be lit. It's not too weird, yeah, okay. you know? Is there anything that you don't like? Um, no, I'm pretty open with Greek food. It's the stuff that's a little too spicy that be getting me. Um, <laughs> they got but, chicken uh, nuggets. I just want to point that out that they do have chicken nuggets. So if you have the palate of a six year old, like I said, Greek food has something for everything. Got you covered. They got a chitlin gyro. You want that? Don't do that. <laughs> well, you know what? I think I'm gonna get you this, uh, this spicy chicken gyro. Oh, the flaming hot Cheeto one? Yeah. I like the colors. I like the color too. It looks really spicy. It looks very aggressive. All right. Place Let's give that, it a try. Place that order in, man. Right. I'm hungry. Well, using your card. So I'm going to go ahead and get a little extra. Okay. That's fine. 
All right, Pat is on his way back in because I can't find my mask and we're still, you know, respecting social distancing and taking all the proper precautions. Uh, but he makes his way back through the obstacle course, which is his desk. <laughs> Yeah. Sure take the pro- proper precautions. As yeah, to I like it. I like Shh. when they staple the bag or tape it. I need that in my life. Stapled. Mm-hmm. Appreciate it. All yeah. right. So we go. This is like Christmas for uh, people who love food. Okay. This is this is what I'm talking about. They got the sauces yes. galore. Listen. All types of. I can't stand when people don't give us no sauce. That white sauce, that red sauce, dude. Red sauce, white sauce. We don't know what it's really called. We go by the colors. Look yeah. at this. Yeah. All types of Come on, cutlery. Utensils? I like that. See that that might be the New York, the New York part. Right? We got the chicken and we got the mix. And uh, I threw in a little. I threw in some falafels. I, I snuck that in at the end. Okay. I mean, it's you know why not? I'm you, not do you I'm like not, falafels? Not. I, I, I don't really know exactly what falafel is. It's a vegetarian uh, uh, option. That looks like it's deep fried. I'm not gonna hold you. It's it's fried. They got the it's it's you know beans and you know vegetarian stuff. I I don't think you know what it is. You I don't know what falafel you is. You didn't sound very convinced. I'm gonna I try don't that know what first. falafel is. Go, go ahead, get here. some. Uh, I need some of that with the, the young white sauce though. Why not? Let's go ahead. Sorry. So you've never had this before? Mm-mm. All right, falafels. a good one it's not bad i really like falafels as a meat substitute Mm -hmm. in like a gyro or whatever you call it like with the white sauce the lettuce and the pita yeah i can see how that can be filling though Mm -hmm. Mm mm-hmm not bad not bad though falafels are good Mm mm-hmm let's get into the gyros all right all right i'm ready i need to feel like i needed to move up son get this mic out the way all right. Mm-hmm. Oh. Let's undress this oh. little thing. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Off top, it looks spicy. I hope you can see that. Let me uh, grab it out the I feel like the frame. I feel like my chicken looks like that, too, though. I don't want my chicken to be that aggressive. So yours is actually spiced chicken mixed with lamb, and I think I just got the straight-up spicy chicken. It looks good, so, uh, I mean, you know that chicken is slapping when it's this color. You know, I don't like chicken that's like sort of white. It looks unseasoned, mm-hmm. bland. I'm gonna add some more sauce to this just to just in case it is super spicy. I gotta get the you gotta get the bare bones first, oh, and then then you get the upgrade nah, with the sauce. Hey man, everybody do it differently, bro. All right, this I, I like to add a little sauce with mine, bro. You feel me? Let's see. That's good. Oh, hell yeah. That is good. You know what's crazy? Before the meat, before the sauce, before everything else, you know mm-hmm. what's really good? The bread. Oh, Peter's. My on. bread is slapping. Hitting. Oh, man. Okay, so I already know the sauce is going to upgrade like a muff. So. Oh, man. Let's try it with the sauce. Hold on. I need a napkin because I already feel myself in a make a mess, bro. With the sauce. And the red sauce, which you know is spicy. I'll mm-hmm. add spicy to spicy. Are you? You, mm-hmm. you're a brave man, bro. Let's go with the brave tactics. Mm-mm. All right, so I'm going to show the newly sauced version. Okay. Just so you guys know, I ain't playing when it comes to the sauce. All right, go ahead mm-hmm. and taste that because I want to I wanna know what it's like. You want to gauge the Yeah, the I want to see how you handle that. Okay. If it ain't too bad, I might, I might pull up. Talk shop. <laughs> you know, the red sauce is mostly flavor. It's not a lot of heat. Really? Yeah. Okay. It's good though. Oh, I it's dabble. Like, you know, a hot sauce when it's not spicy, it has to hit like flavor wise. Oh. Oh, you know what? It is. It does have a kick. Why would you lie? Because I think. Why would you? It does have a good flavor, though. But wow. Mm. I think what happened was the bite I got didn't have that much on it, and then I poured some more and licked my finger, and I was like, "Ooh, yeah." What was I talking about? It's got a little something in there. It got a little something in there. It's a little I'm smoky. Mmm. Mm. Oh, this is great. 
the, the, like you said, the bread is good. Mm-hmm. When you really sauce it up, <clears throat> uh-oh, <clears throat> getting that spice, I, it's starting to hit me too. It's a mm-hmm. slow, it's a slow burn. Mm-hmm. Okay. How's the lamb? <clears throat> it's uh, it's pretty good. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Turn into Tony Baker. <laughs> I feel like I was gonna say I feel like one of Tony Baker's characters right now. Mm-hmm. That spice is uh. Ooh, it's sneaking up. Mm-hmm. Ooh, it's sneaking up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know what? It's crazy, but I kind of like it with mm-hmm. the spice. I love this. I spice. feel like it, it slows me down because I would like destroy this in like five minutes. It's when that spice was like, nah, it's gonna fill every piece. You gonna chew every bite. And I'm like, you're right. I realize Josh. that the it, when you a gyro is a little different than a taco because that front lip pokes out. Mm-hmm. So when I poured all that sauce on, I think that first bite didn't have no red sauce on it. Man. So now that I'm eating it, mm-hmm. it's a little mm. different. Woo. All right, I'm gonna have to. Uh, I'm gonna have to finish this after the show is over because I gotta take my pants off for this. Please, yeah. Let's um, let's have you hold off on that till later. <laughs> um, ooh, yeah, it, it's it keeps going. That sauce keeps going. All right. So what? How are we feeling about this? How are we feeling about? <sighs> it's flavorful. Mm-hmm. It's a little bit new. Yeah. And it, it it's spicy. I, I sometimes I'm not really in the mood for spicy, but. Spicy is good when it's like the flavor is there. Sometimes yeah. it's just spicy and that's it. It's just like a challenge or something, but yeah. it's it's solid. I'm really, really enjoying this. Even though I'm fighting through the tears, I'm giving it a nine out of ten. Oh wow. hmm That's very gracious. That's great. It is really good. I will say that. The red sauce did surprise me. Oh man. Um really good on that right there. Um I'm I'm liking everything about it for the most part. I just I, I don't know, like I don't First time just rain the things high, I'll be feeling some type of way. But I can't take away from the fact that it's delicious. I'm going to enjoy eating this, the rest of it. And um, I, I give it an 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. High numbers. I give it an 8 out of 10. It was good. I did, the, it. did the lamb bring it down? Do you think it would have been better if it was just the chicken? I don't know. I can't really say. I you will could say just bite one half lamb, of it. Yeah, the lamb didn't didn't take anything away from it for me. I will say that. Oh. Is it like chewy? Game? No, it's, it's tender. Okay. You want to get in there? Yeah, let, me grab a piece, let, me, let me grab a piece of baby sheep. It's just weird when you say it. It's good, right? It's actually pretty fire. What does it taste like? I don't know, but it's low-key almost more fire than the chicken to me. Low-key. You know what it tastes like? It tastes like when you have, um, the, it tastes like the meatball and spaghetti. I can see that. I was trying to figure it out, but that's actually really, really good. That's actually pretty good. Okay. All right, well. Listen, that's been another Baby episode sheep. of... Stop it, damn it. They're tasty. They're tasty. <laughs> just stop it. That's been another episode of Lunchtime Lottery, man. If you guys are ever in the L.A. or the Valley area, make sure you check out New York Chicken and Gyro. 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 Whatever it's yeah. called. Yeah, that, you know it when you see it, though. You'll see it. You know it. Um, Fire, man. I give it an 8 out of 10. Pat gives it a 9 out of 10. We want to hear what you think, man. If you've ever had it before, post it in the comments. How'd you guys enjoy it? And what did you try? Mm-hmm. And, uh, yeah, we'll see you on the next episode of Lunchtime Lottery. Later. Peace.